What's up, guys? My name is K Boss, and today we are going to be going over episode 9 of our All About the Clone series. And today's episode is going to be on All About Sapper. I know Hong Tian is kind of excited about this episode today, but anyways, guys, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. Let's go. Alright, so there's not really a bunch about Sapper. Well, there kind of is, but um. Okay, Sapper. Let's read his description. It says here that Sapper is a. He's a common clone, obviously. Sapper is carrying three dangerous landmines, and he is not afraid to drop them anywhere. Not even on your backyard. So, you guys gotta watch out for Sapper dropping his mines on your backyard. Because that's just a little dangerous, you know. Anyways, mine, sap, my Sapper is a level 6. As you can see, like that beautiful landmine right there and right there. Um, 240 out of 500 to upgrade him to level 7. It would cost 3,000. Um... His price is 300, I guess it's fair. His health is 255, and his damage is 76, which I actually think is the lowest damaging gun in the whole game. The Sapper gun. I think it's the lowest damaging one. Uh, the speed is 45, I guess that's kind of mature. And the mine damage is 178, so basically Sapper's only defense line is his mine count, which does 178 damage on level 6. And his mine count is three, of course. Let's check out his skins. Alright, so, apparently there's some glitch where it would cost 15 coins to buy the whole Christmas pack skin for Sapper. And I think it's just only for him and Chopper, I think. I think him and Chopper are the only clones that can get the Christmas skin right now. I guess it was just some glitch that Nith added, or maybe a secret, I don't know. Um... Okay, well, as you can see, I applied the Christmas skin. Uh, the Colonel skin costs 500. It looks like three packs of dynamite. It's like some green stuff in there. He's got his revolver of pistol in there. He's got a... <coughs> Excuse me. Bless me, K-Boss. All right. It's locked, of course. Uh, he's got that mustache. He also is Russian because of that hat. Just like Bob's hat. Bob the Marksman, if you guys don't know. Of course, he's barefoot, camouflage. That kind of makes sense, because, you know, he's a colonel. But the mustache, though, is what is the best, man. The mustache. And as you can see, the basic skin kind of looks lame. Uh, just normal. Three landmines on the back. Looks like they're gonna blow up on top of each other. But, you know, it is what it is. Let's try him in the showroom. Alright, Sapper. See, just look at how much damage he does to the giant. Like, barely any. And this was, like, 20 shots already, right? And he doesn't do much to the, to the privates either, even a level 1. Which is kind of a shaming. 1. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 8. 7, 8 shots. 8 shots just to kill a level, just, just to kill a level 9. Um, also, another thing that you could do that's pretty cool is you can, when you, you whenever you get inside of a clone, you can actually p press the landmine button, and it'll blow them up, because it places them. And you can set down landmines over here, and, like, when this clone, for example, walks over here, he can step on it, and boom, he gets blown into the atmosphere. And let's check his health. His health, yeah, he doesn't have lots of health, but, I mean, yeah. Some people, if they if they get bored, they create like a whole minefield for some reason. It looks it looks pretty cool. Okay, this is Engineer's Century Tier Tier One testing area. See, Sapper doesn't really have that much health, really, especially when he's trying to run away from that, and it's not really that good. Um, but yeah, that's really all that Sapper does. His gun is just just in case. Like if you set down those three landmines, you can really just set them anywhere. You can set them on platforms. Really, anywhere. I don't think he can do it on this one. Yeah, he can't. It just, it just, whoa. It just falls off. Oh, yeah. Anyways, guys, in conclusion, if you step on these landmines, you're basically going to be blown up into space. So, uh, yeah. He might plant them in your backyard, so don't be surprised if you see landmines. The sapper's probably just going to come across and just say, Oh, sorry, uh, K-Boss. I placed your landmines in your backyard. Heck, since most of my viewers are from Vietnam, they don't really have backyards because they probably live in apartments. No offense to you guys, but apartments are cool. Alright, I, I, I kind of want an apartment too because like, except like the noisiness. Noisiness are kind of weird. But yeah, you guys probably don't have apartments. I'm sorry, I'm kind of being a hypocrite right now. Um, or I'm stereotyping, I'm sorry, but hypocrite. Why did I say that? 
Hey, boss, you're not a hypocrite. Okay. I'm sorry, that might have sounded offensive to some of you guys, but... Alright, I'm sorry. Okay, well, really, there's really not much you can do with Sapper except the landmines. I mean, those are really cool, obviously. Uh, barely does any damage to giants. Barely does any damage to infantry. Like, in conclusion, his gun, it's not really... It doesn't really do that much, you know? His gun isn't the best to use, but it's not the worst either. So, um, yeah. I just feel like he's just one of those chill clones that just likes everything. Uh, but, except he's probably gonna complain to everyone that, uh... Joseph, why did you create me like this? Why landmines? Come on, Sapper. Or, come on, Joseph. Really? A landmine? But, yeah. As you can see, I'm just kind of stalling right now for time. His Sapper gun doesn't really do that much, but... Yeah, that's really all there is. There's not much to Sapper, really. Uh, this is episode 9, correct? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... Yeah, this is episode 9, guys. I believe the Gunner episode is going to be on September 10th, and it's going to be also the Twins Challenge solo. So, uh, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe if you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a love. Um, I love you guys. Uh, no, I meant I like you guys. I'm sorry. I, I can't be gay. All right, no homo. Uh, you guys are, like, the best. Uh, thank you for watching, guys. Goodbye.